Hello everyone, it's I, Sakamoto. Welcome back to more Undertale Yellow with me, your boy, Sakamoto. Woohoo! Get hyped! Yeah! <laughs> Sorry, can't talk long. I'm preparing for the harvest. Must be one of those Wild East folks. Huh? No, I didn't say anything. Have you been to Snowden? I've heard rumors of our crops being cultivated around those parts. I'm thinking of opening up an investigation soon. I'm not bored or anything. Just want to protect the business. <laughs> Don't you have role playing to do or something? Shootouts, inconvenience, and pedestrians. That's all bro does after all. He's always up to something. <laughs> Having fun while I'm stuck with the farm work. Uh, okay, so that's his brother. The cellar is locked. Must be where the harvest is stored. You attempt to turn the pump on, but the handle will budge. Welcome to Sunnyside Farm. It ain't much, but we call it home. My name's Solomon. You must be from Stalos Town, eh? I have mixed feelings about it, uh, about it all, if I'm being honest. The boy rarely talks to us. It's a shame. He probably thinks we hate his life choices, but that just ain't true. It's because of him that our farm stayed in business during the old drought. His little town attracted monsters to this area after most moved away. I believe that deep down, saving the farm was his true motivation, I do. Oh, hello, little one. Are you a friend of my son's? He's always making new friends. I can't keep up. In any case, make yourself at home. <laughs> All right. Uh, the fireplace is riddled with cobwebs, regular cobwebs. You check in between the cushions for loose change. All you find are crumbs and kernels. A dirty hat similar to Starla's rests on the rack. Always good to have a backup. Something about the shoes. Okay. Wait, there's a plant. A painting of a lush valley surrounded by mountains. Oh, there's also that. <laughs> the stove is oddly high tech. You feel a slight heat over its surface. Okay. Nothing special, just a lamp. A picture of Starlo and Sarah as teenagers. Oh, isn't that special? A dust displaying Western memorabilia in a sewing machine. A piece of fabric under the machine has been left unfinished. That's so cool. I don't think I noticed that last time I played. That's awesome. Wow. A double-decker rocket ship ready to blast off into pleasant dreams. See a space cowboy. I don't, oh yeah, okay. Oh yeah, I noted that too in the last time I played. That's, a, that's an awesome uh, reference to Cowboy Bebop if you've ever seen that anime. I don't know if uh, it's in the live-action one because I haven't watched it. A thick farmer's almanac written by Solomon sits on the dresser. It has several sticky notes poking out of its pages. Just some floor corn, you know how it is. Alright. Okay. Bye! See you later, alligators! I got stuff to do! Y'all don't understand. I'm on an important mission. <laughs> Hello again, I have some news. You now can ship yourself if you so choose. Ship myself, what could that mean? Transportation, all for free. If you want to travel, give me a call. We will set to the skies without a care at all. I must go, but don't be nervous. Just ring the bell for our service. So yeah, we unlock fast travel, but we don't need it right now. I do want to check my mail though. Hello, greetings, hip hop hooray. <laughs> or hip hip hooray. What can I do for you today? You have a watch? If you don't, that's fine, because you know what a time it is. Mail time, mail time. You receive mail. I truly hope you like your mail. As for me, I must set sail. <clears throat> Excuse me. Well, that didn't do anything. <laughs> it still sound like, ah, frogman. Uh, crap. Okay, um. Mail. Delve! Greetings, Clover. Life has been a treat since we last saw each other. I packed up all of my belongings and set out for Snowden. 
I recently found a nice place to settle down. I think you'll like it. Oh, and all of the neighbors moved out with me. Moved out with me. I'm not I'm not too sure where each, where each one went, but I know they are doing well. I'm also taking art lessons from Penilla now. She gave me the cold truth and said my art needed lots of improvement. It stung at first, but then I remembered that you should always aim to improve yourself. Ah, oh, look at me rambling again. I hope the mail service doesn't charge extra for that. <laughs> It was nice to talk to you again, even if it is over written text. Please visit me in the future. Life is getting a lot better, Dalv. <sighs> there you are! I was about to come looking for you. So, the steam works. May I ask why we are here? <sighs> because of this. The mask Conoco made for you. Yes. You see, Clover, Kanako is me and Eugene's only child. You haven't seen her around because she... Hey, everything will be okay. I know how tough you are. You can move past this, I'm positive. There's no need, because she's alive. I feel her presence as we speak. The lab, precisely. Clover, you may not know this, but there is a lab in Hotland. An inquiry for the fallen down was sent out some time ago. I didn't know what else to do. In my time of despair, I sent Kanako with them. It's been far too long and I haven't heard anything. I must travel to the lab to find out where my daughter is. I'm proud of you, Saraba, stepping out and taking charge. You've been in a rut lately. It was tough to watch. So, why travel through the steamworks particularly? It's the quickest route to Hotland from there. Nothing but abandoned rooms as far as I know. I have Chujin's old passcodes for any locked doors as well. Solid plan. If you need me, I would be happy to accompany you. I don't know how ugly things get at the lab things that the lab may get. You need You need to stay here and take care of the town. I believe you owe your posse an apology. Go right. I'll take Clover with me. They've proven to be skilled on several fronts. An excellent choice. I trust Clover to deliver justice out there. Alright, we've discussed enough. Let's get moving. Alright, we've discussed enough. Let's get moving. Blah, 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 blah. Don't mind me. <laughs> I'll see you later, Stylo. Whatever happens, remember that this is... Ch remember that this is for Chujin's legacy. Alright. Oh, Clover, before you go, I forgot to give you this. You got the deputy badge. To spot a few hiccups, our little adventure was a blast. I'll be seeing you around, partner. <laughs> I'm so proud. Remember, I'm in charge. Stay close by and we'll reach our destination soon. Ah! Keep up, Clover. We don't have all the time in the world. I was trying not to get all emotional <laughs> during that last scene. But they made it so hard with the damn music. I see something. Follow me. And there's a part that's coming up that's going to be even harder not to get emotional at. Guess I should have expected this. In its prime, this was the main power source of the underground. That, obviously, was many, many years ago. Until we breathe life back into this thing, we can't progress. Ah, yeah, that was terrible. <laughs> Sorry. There's some kind of console here. Maybe one of Chujin's codes will work? Just give me a second. In the meantime, you can wait over in the corner or something. Yeah, okay. That's what we're going to do.
Damn, I almost had it. Okay, now what? What the heck? How's that? I'll just out it. Oh, okay, I know what to do. I think. I don't think you can reset it. Oh, wait a minute. Zero, zero. What do you mean? I don't know, when I did this before, it just kind of worked. It just kind of worked out. If I would just get to this point, then it would be fine. This is the one on the left at this hole? Oh, okay. Got it, finally. Almost got it. Didn't think this would actually work. Oh, we have to go to this other door. Howdy! Another team up? You're wasting your time, buddy. So far, these monsters have only brought you misfortune. I feel like following that lady's orders won't end any differently. Especially with that Leia business. Just try your best and just try your best to move things along and not get sidetracked. Hopefully we can talk soon. Good luck, Clova. Let's get you saved. Doors jammed shut. You find a stick of beef jerky inside the machine. Sweet. The chute is clogged with strange looking plants. The smell of the old unwashed clothes makes you feel queasy. A pair of cargo jeans is stuck to the table. It's been there a while. Excuse me. Aha! I know what we need to do. Something over here, lol. Hit the switch. <laughs> That's it. Wait, what have you been up to? Oh, I wasn't actually doing anything this whole time, was I? Ugh, alright, you're clearly more capable of problem solving. I suppose you should lead the way from now on. Just head west from here and we'll reach Hotland eventually. Aha, I made it through. That's the part I was talking about. This is I hit you with the music, man. It's just your brain gets kind of brainwashed there sometimes for a second. I don't know how to put it. This is the steam works, by the way. In case you didn't already know that. What luck? What luck? Turn the power on, and the whole facility goes insane. Since you're the leader now, though, how about you run ahead and turn the steam off? I think I see a switch over there. It's no problem, right? Don't worry, I'll catch up.
I thought there was only two bosses left, there's actually three. Oh well. Excellence in the Engineering Award. Dr. Rutherford's Oscar. Decency in the Engineering Award. Professor Daniels. The Giant Engineering Award. Mr. Tudine. He never. He never told me he won an award. I'm proud of him. Greatness in C. You can't make out the rest. You tried an engineering award. Shuji and Katsukane. Oh boy, here we go. Another character I love to play. Axis, model 014, ready to guard and protect. Intruder spotted. Steamworks, Eastern Branch. Wait, who are you? Axis model 014 ready to guard and protect. You just said that. My vocabulary is not expansive, ma'am. Okay, well, I wasn't expecting anyone to be here. If you just, if you just let us through, we'll be out of your hair. One, I do not have hair. Two, I cannot allow you to pass. You have trespassed on private property. You have also utilized machinery without permission. No, no, we're just heading that way. We aren't malicious in the slightest. It is us who woke up this place. Isn't it nice to have power? While it is nice to be operational again, it is also not nice. I am the last of my kind to police this area. All of my comrades have rusted over. I always knew I was the best, but I also am lonely. But I am also lonely now. Oh well. I will now trap you in a cold, dark room for which you might perish. My husband, Shujin, used to work here. I have permission. I have... I have permission. Don't make me hurt you. Chujin, my creator. Huh? Sorry. I didn't I do not see him present. Goodbye. Wait! Ouch. Can't say I was prepared for that. I knew my husband was an engineer, but he never told me about that guy. He mentioned a robotics project that could net him a promotion, but he stopped talking about it after he quit his job here. Ugh. I would have used force to bypass Axis, but I, I'm not sure how. He may be the last remnant of Shuji's talent. It would be best if we could just avoid him from now on. In any case, we're, the, we're pretty lucky he's the only guard, ar guard bot around. Wait a second. I have an idea. He mentioned how he was lonely, right? Well, what if we fix that? Sorry, I had a brain freeze for a second. We could use scraps lying around to forge a companion for him. He doesn't seem too bright after all. Maybe that's all we need to distract him. What do you think? Yes. Great. That's the best plan I could think of. So, we seem to be in some sort of storage room. Look around for parts we could use. Shouldn't take me. So basically you just look around for random stuff and I uh, hope that it's going to help you out. <sighs> the trash can in my original Let's Play. I kind of want to show you guys what, how, how I made my first one. It was so funny. <laughs> You wanna use this? Uh, no. Oh, but I can't. Once I pick what I pick, it's, that's gonna be it. You know what? Screw it. I'll, I will make the one I made before, because it worked out fine anyway. Give me the bow. Now you, I would use this for the head, but 
I didn't notice that until like after I'd already picked four parts and I, I think I grabbed this for the head originally, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know. Oh well, you know what I think it was this. Give me, give me this. Thank you. And it, oh yeah, and I grabbed the TV too, that was it. I remember now. I think. Let me make sure there's no other hidden objects. Speaker. Where did I grab this thing? I guess the whatever for a body will work, right? The googly eyes. <laughs> the man has a few of screws. Yeah, give me the TV. Yeah, I think it was the TV. Is this your final choice? Okay, let's build a robot. Let's see here. Um, <laughs> it already looks ridiculous. This is taking forever! Whatever. I think I gave all the heads bows. And that was it. <laughs> what a great fake robot, eh guys? Oh. <laughs> all done? Um, I'm not sure about this design, but okay. It's perfect. It takes care of that. You're kind of creative when a push comes to shove. <laughs> I'll do I'll do to respect your choosing's work, but this might just full access. This this type this might just full access. I'll hold on to it for you. Let's get out of here, yeah. Sorry, I I had been me for so long I forgot I was supposed to be acting. <laughs> That's why that last part was so bad. <laughs> that door is locked. Oh man. Okay, we gotta use the vent. The vent has a few li a few of screws. You can mangle it open. Can't Ah, oh, excuse me. Can't say that was fun. Let's be extra cautious from now on, okay?
Wait, another robot? I will never take out the trash. You can't make me. No way, we can't fight this thing. What if two didn't build? You know what? We'll talk later. I plan a piece slowly around them. I'll do my best to provide the rent for us. Gandroid tosses garbage this way and that. You look the Android over and tell them they need a shower. <laughs> Don't come any closer! Damn it. Is that what the deputy badge does? I don't know. That's general what their primary directive is. To clean- to help conquer- I mean, help all germs conquer the land- oh. Crap. This is hard! Jeez. Smells like four choices. Big Gemini is intended. You're rude, take this. You, help. Here I find you too hygienic. That'd be a badge or something you have on automatically. Yeah. Go down. Where are you going down? Okay. What the heck? Oh, that's all right. Okay. That's right. That's right. I remember that. It's a dead end. Looks like we're gonna have to... The, the, the floor is lava, Traveler. I am sorry to say I have failed the game some time ago. However, you do not have to. You do not have to. I will ferry you across the lake. This spot doesn't seem malicious. That's me. I say we give it a go. Thank you for your trust. With my help, the floor will not be lava. It will just be floor. Poster with smiling monster with a slogan about them. Tomorrow means the surface. Oh, sorry. Uh, safety is priority. Wear your steamwork safety goggles during work hours. Always keep your what? Keep your steamwork ID with you. Decontaminate yourself of any biohazards before leaving the premises. Most of all, have fun. Tick-tock, tick-tock, tick-tock. The current time is 6.26, Monday morning. You may have noticed the apple trees outside the steamworks are blooming. That means spring is upon us. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I'll just keep doing this. Later. This time of year, my creator recommends a picnic by the river just south of here. Why the puzzle look? Have we not met before? I have the grandfather clock of the underground. It is my responsibility to keep the standard time for all monsters. However, I cannot help but feel there's a miscalculation in my tick-talking. It is simply driving me mad. I should have done an old man voice. Like a big old man voice. Like, oh, I'm an old man, blah, blah, blah. But, <laughs> whatever. Take a, take a ride. Wait. I'm confuzzled. Okay. This place confused the crap out of me last time too. But I don't think it'll be that confusing this time. I think I know what to do.
Again? Well, let's, let's get on with it. Watch your step. I've heard of Piggy backing on others to get ahead, but yeah, this is weird. We just went backwards, didn't we? I'm not lost, I swear! Humans also run on earth, but it's called blood. Apparently, it doesn't taste like good, which is like a total shame. Well, that was interesting. Didn't do that last time I played. Okay. You have reached your destination, too. Thanks for the help. Let's keep moving, Clover. If you need another ride, I'll be here to... Oh god. Here we go. Escape convicts plotted. <laughs> Steamworks office branch. Oh no, run! Halt, you're coming with me. 
stay here while I get the tall lady. Do not touch anything. A portable coolant dispenser. Handy. Trash can. Have you seen my wife? The security station would be useful as tracking roaming robots if there were any cameras in the steamworks. The mummified remains of an abandoned pizza party. Not even you are brave enough to try to slice. <laughs> Game comments on how he's always picking up the old food. <laughs> That's funny. The security station would be useful to track roaming robots if there were any... Yeah, we already read that. Yeah, this is where we want to go. Took me like 10 tries to do this last time. I almost made it this time, but... Running from Axis, take 13? 14? I don't even know, I lost count. I wasn't counting every single one. Maybe eight. I wonder if they made it easier. That's why I'm so far ahead of him now. Each time you fail running from Axis, we make it easier to get away from him. Great. I feel like a true gamer now. Clover, lockers, follow me. Ah. <laughs> uh. How? I don't know, I really suck. Don't ask me. Huff, oh, huff. Oh. This guy needs business. My husband was a, one hell of an engineer. I just wonder why he kept all this from me. He could have left me some sort of off switch, right? The robot! I totally forgot about our plan. Ugh, sorry. Next time we see Axis, we'll try your plan. We'll try your plan. Found you. Every time I tried running to the left or walking to the left, he would always shoot in that same spot and I would always get hit by it. So the only way that I found to really dodge that stuff is to do as, as I'm doing here and just keep running like this. Every time he shoots, run to the right and I immediately go back so you can gain ground. Just hit. Okay, it was auto going. Looks like he's got... <laughs> Axis, hold on a second. One. Uh, one million seconds. I do not have the knowledge to count that high. What is this about? I have a surprise for you, a special one. I will admit, you have my attention. Proceed. I have for you, your very own robot companion. A sleek, top of the line model. Aren't they beautiful? No. Not in the mood. My eyes are only set on your apprehension. Goodbye. You're making them cry, Axis. Come on now. Robots cannot cry. I have tried. Goodbye. Well, it was worth a shot. Plan C it is. I am immobile. If you went with our surprise, it wouldn't have gotten messy. Do not mock my judgment. I will return to capture you with new hands. <laughs> Phew, I'm spent. Next chair we see, I'm taking a breather. Here you go. Well, there we go. Definition. Definition. <laughs> Definitely what I need after that madness. Dun, dun, dun. I wonder what Starlo is up to right now. Probably on some feisty five quest with a smile on his face. I do envy him. Do you wrapped in optimism and fantasy? Most might act cheerful, but life down here is hopeless. That's why they look to the king for assurance. They believe one they believe once he gets seven souls and breaks the barrier, he'll easily be able to salt he'll bleh, he'll easily be able to overthrow whatever awaits on the surface. A rather foolish outlook if you ask me. Who knows how the humans have prepared for retaliation since then? But I digress. We should handle our own problems first. 
I can't imagine what Kanako's going through right now. You haven't seen my Kanako yet, have you? Here, take a look. Look at that smile. Definitely your father's. Gifted like her father, too. She's a... She didn't deserve this life. I truly wish things could be different, but that's not what fate had planned. I apologize for my vagueness. I prefer to keep the bad memories to myself. Anyway, the lab shouldn't be horribly far from here. We will get to the bottom of this, Clover. In the meantime, you can scout ahead. I'm going to rest a bit longer. Okay. Pending model 01, system boot. Scanning customer. Unauthorized child detected. Go away. Why, 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 why? Oh yes, I will gladly dispense your garbage. Hand it over. Please stop. This will kill you. Heals 30 HP. Unfiltered. Dirt. Bad. Dihydrogen monoxide. Gravity granola. Pot potato chips. Safety goggles. Will blind you. Attitude, this game works. Code line 327. If a customer is determined unauthorized, treat them with utmost disrespect so they will not buy up the company snacks. My disrespectful state was initiated when I scanned your dull face. Bring a Steamworks employee ID next time to experiments. To experiments. To experiment. Experience hospital mode. Until then, you may purchase items, but I will tear apart your self esteem while you do so. Loser. Steamworks. What about it? The Steamworks are only the finest in monster science and engineering. No big deal or anything. Structures built from the toughest steel and the greatest mines sure to stand the taste test for of several millennia. Searching for a more advanced facility would be like searching for the corner of a circle. With quality machines such as myself at every turn, lives are improved every day. The Steamworks tomorrow means the surface. I am not a propaganda machine. My creator made sure I specify that. Axis. Searching for Axis in the database. Axis, latest model 14. is a robot built to act as a royal guard. Production goal. Create an army of Axis guard bots to protect monster kind from humanity. Production status discontinued. That is all the information I have on this robot. If I were to be helpful, which I will not be, I will tell you to ask an engineer in the factory wing for more information. Where's the factory wing? I cannot tell you. You are unauthorized. Not that I trust you to find it on your own since you are, in fact, an idiot. My snacks are up to the highest Steamworks, sna Steamworks standards. I ensure the employees' designated meal times are as enjoyable as possible. Because of my popularity, I often run out of inventory to which my creator restocks every Monday at 8 o'clock. That reminds me, my last boot up yesterday was a Sunday. Dr. R.O. should be stopping by any minute now. I simply cannot wait. But none of that is your business, is it? Mind defense. Bye, thanks for nothing. Down the stunning highlighter yellow jacket. You're already took care of Memphis.
Oh, uh, maybe I should have went to go sell the feather. Whatever, I forgot there's a fast travel place nearby. An old bottle, no message inside. The message is clear. Uh, set myself one by one. Not too clever. We don't want to learn any outsiders, especially workers in the restaurant like the UGPS. You may well have to wait. Well, it's 5.57. Should I keep recording? I don't know. You tell me, me. Hmm. Yes. Come on. Just scream if something makes an attempt on your life. Okay. Howdy! Howdy! Boy, am I glad that fox lady let you run free for a bit. Not being able to talk to my pal has been torture. Now, I know she roped you into some lab detour, but... Come on, Captain Monsters, talk about a conspiracy nut. I mean, it's like you don't want to follow my advice. Remember, you remember your real mission, Clover. The five children you set out to find in the first place. There's no need to visit that dingy lab, you know? Escort's still out there threatening human lives. Keep your head in the game. This is not- this is our journey, not Cerebus. Hey, wait up! I think I'm ready to get back into things. Lead the way. Music has come to share some sounds. Um... Try to do what can't keep up. If you can't provide this, give it up! New gyms should not appreciate the current situation. New introducing needle to a new comma record. Um, record. Wait, I. Oh? Excuse me. And close your eyes and tap the click for me. This is crazy. This is nice. I'm not dealing with that. <laughs> More steam, fantastic. One more time, Clover. You got this. Ah! Thanks, Deputy Badge. Ah! <laughs> Deputy Badge, save me again! If you need- if I need you. Yeah. Lol. Lol, 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 lol. Aha, I made it. He just did it himself. Cool. Uh, alrighty then. Ooh, clouds. Or no. Moss. Or something. Flowers. What happened here? I hope this stuff is okay to touch. Dried up fountain lies before you. It doesn't look remotely operational anymore. Various types of plants sit with it. Several containers. As well as unnatural. You peer into the box and find a bucket of nails. Take them. Not enough inventory space. Got a robot. They're much more silent than you used to. T 
to science division. Employees are reported the generator is showing more wear than ever. The engineers predict the machine won't last longer than one year from now. We need you to speed up the testing of alternate power, power sources. The underground depends on it. Head office. Uh, grown over robot, you can almost see it. Face on the screen. To head office. More tests are underway, both biological and mechanical. We don't know which direction will ultimately be best for Monster Kind yet. However, the chemistry lab did, a, did have a breathtaking breakthrough regarding a white plant. I'll get back to you on that once further testing has commenced. Science division. I think we've got it. Two head office. I think we've got it. The white plants have proven able to generate electricity at a fantastic rate. The only issues are that they grow four times faster than normal flora, and once their power is drained, they will into a dark, sticky substance. If this is greenlit, we will need to we will need a new division to tend to these plants. Otherwise, working conditions will suffer greatly. Science condition. Science condition. Science division. Grown up robot seems more forgotten than the rest. You avoid touching some exposed wires on their back. This one looks like it could cut you. Um you notice a small hat resting on top of them. Science division. The plants should suffice as a temporary solution. I've heard one of our top scientists is working toward a new compound, one made from special energy. It could be the key we need. Much more time is necessary to develop it properly, however. As for the proposed greenhouse division, I have an idea. Cheaper, more efficient, and trustworthy. I'll send you some blueprints shortly. Thank you for your time and research at office. Hold up blueprints, light in the box. You take a look. done with this episode, I think. Great. That's not good about that one. What was that? I grab my soda. Hold on. Bye. Am awake. <sighs> Gardener model zero two status damaged. Oh, he hello there. Was it you who disturbed the flora? I ask you to please have more respect. Um, we apologize. Won't happen again. Do not worry. Seeing that the child is so young, it is forgivable. Our I will report the incident as a level 303 level evil 10 offense. Or level 10 offense. Level 10 means the termination of the trampler. Hold on. Farewell. Yeah. I'm stuck, Clover. I need to find, find a way out of this fast. The great hostility is blossoming. I did not mean to do that. I have incapacitated your options. I ask you to cooperate with me. Oh, crap, 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 I forgot about the pattern. Except your offense, Trampler. I kinda wish I had the Silver Scarf. Looks like lawnmower clippings. You must learn the plant life is important, more important than you. If you do not yield, I will call for backup. You are a handful. I'm going to count to three. my cage. One. Ah! Two. Stop bluffing.
three, calling back up. You called for help, Farmer? Correct. This trampler does not value the greenhouse. What is the level of offense this? Ten. Termination. Level ten? I mean, of course. We are sorry, offender. Gardner says you deserve termination. They know. I just said that. So, attack. Right. This is only getting worse. Don't stop your efforts to free us. Keep it up. Please stay in your confines. Way to go! I'll do what I can to help us escape for good. Cleverly really done. You'll gain my respect, but you'll not gain my mercy. Box attack. Great. Oh crap! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Adequate job. Thank you for your help. No problem, Gardner. Yeah, give us a call anytime. You need to hang out or something. Not that bad. Or not. It's no big deal. I'm moving and out of the ground all around you. Yeah, I didn't die. Just you and I again. It's too bad I can't grow tired for you, that is. Garner twitches at an alarming rate. This can't be good for her. Okay. Sleep with Gardner and it seems to have an effect. Offense level lowered. I'm here for the attack. Oh, you missed it. Seriously? Man. Hey, it is okay. Here, a flower to cheer you up. Yo, thanks. Mind if I attack a little? By all means. My spores swirl through the air. Still standing, or rather upsetting. You tell Garner that this is a misunderstanding. Lower defense level lower. Just wait until my creator hears about this. We'll get a long lecture. A lecture more painful than anything I am doing. Through torture. No cars, go away. Almost done. <laughs> After that, the head office will give you an award. Excellence in ruining Gardener's Day. Deserved. <laughs> well, this wasn't as hard as it was the first time I did this. First time I did this, it took me like three tries. Wait, you, you. Offense level lower. Oh, what happened? There seems to be a gap in my memory core. I am sorry. I think that, I think that did the trick. You're pretty clever in intense situations. I am impressed. Garner cools down as steam steeps from her eyes. 50 gold. Holy moly. Zoli McBoli Dolly. I was about to do something. Oh yes, I remember sending level 3 report. Response negative. I apologize. Allow me to call again. Sending level 3 report. Hello, creator. Are you there? 
I believe my creator may be playing a practical joke on me. Signaling Steamworks head office. Be the line you are contacting has been disconnected. Where, where is everybody? Oh, I have a lot of immense overgrowth. I understand. It seems a day has passed. Cancel, re cancel report and reinitiate hibernation. Hibernation sequence engaged. I am sorry for inconveniencing you. I do not know what the world is like now, nor do I wish to. Life was much better not knowing. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving, let's keep moving, let's keep moving, schmoving, screwing. What the heck? Oh, hey, look at that. How convenient. We'll go that way next time on Undertale Yellow with me, your boy, Sakamoto. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Got to be proud of our boy Clover here, stepping up and doing shit and here about just standing there <laughs> and being like, oh my god. Yeah, it was cool. Anyways, enough rambling. Love you guys. Have a great day.